Hello and welcome to this video. I am going to be rearranging this stuff. Yeah. Fun. Alright. So first I'm going to be taking these out. No hermit crabs are in here. So that's good. So, um, I'm going to be taking this out too. Oops. And right here. Whoa. See that? I don't know if you did. Take that out because my hand comes right there. Oh, I'll leave this one in. I don't know if you see that or not. But my light thing is like f twitching or flick flashing on and off. Alright, I'm going to be swapping out my food dish right now, this one, with this one, for the smaller crabs, so I can get in and eat. Um, I'm going to take this out. showed you earlier that was over in that corner came up from a molt she or he's not very active right now so I shouldn't have given him the name Activo so that stinks I want him to be active as much as ombre but that's hard I'm putting him back. The only hermit crab that is still molting that I know for sure is Excavadora and then Loka's just over there. Not even buried fully. Um what's his name? Mikai? Oh yeah, he's right up here. Over there, buried where that vine ends, right over there. So I can't do stuff over there, which stinks. Just want them to be up and active. So this stuff right here. Alright, let's see. I added, I added a pool. For them to go in with bubbles and stuff. Um, look, it's just right there. Then ombre is right there. Active wall. And then, let's see if I can show you a little bit. Mikai, right there. I'm not going to bother him or anything, just in case he is multi- You saw that. What the heck is up with that? I don't think it's screwed in all the way. I'll fix that later. Alright. Take this stuff out. My 
rock out. Then you need to stop. And the first, oh shoot, alright, the first thing that I have had was full of gravel and sand and it wasn't great so I used the extra gravel and I put it in here for, for them to stand on and so it's not super deep. And I can put this. Right over here. Alright, so that's how this is the place without everything. I'll well, take this out. I don't know if Activo is inching out or not. It looks like it. Here, let's see. Yeah, I think he is. Keep him right there. Let's see how he does. Alright, I'm see if his hole is still there, actually. Oh, I thought this was someone, or one of somebody's shell. It's not. Thank the Lord. Do not comment anything bad about that, what I just said. Please. No arguments. Shoot. This thing needs to... Alright, I'm gonna just drop this. Alright. If you heard that, that was my throat. It's probably not there anymore. It probably just squished his hole. I don't know. Maybe there's still stuff down there. Parts of his body home. I just move the light. Is there like burying Loka almost? Alright, there's nothing that I see there. Wait, I'm put the thing over here. That's what I was gonna do. Ow! I'm falling. Ow. Oh shoot, mm, not bury Loka. That'd be good. How this looks. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Gotta like move it in deeper though. Alright. Level that out. Alright, now I can put this in. Time to move everything. Squish everything down. What I picked up from other people's YouTubes is to like just don't touch them, don't touch the hermit crabs, let them do what they want. And right now he's inching out. He's probably getting more comfortable in his spot where I just moved him or he just wants to move out of the place where I put him. Which is most likely the idea he wants. Clean out my shells. I'll do that later. I don't forget. Rewatch this video. Yeah. Make sure I don't bury other crabs either. So scary. I think they could survive though if I buried them. I'm not planning on doing it, but if I accidentally did, they'd be able to get out, wouldn't they? Alright. I'll move that right there. 
Alright, here. And then ombre. You need a move. Oh well, I'm gonna leave it there. I'm gonna put these back here. Okay. Then. Oops. Alright, this is a good spot for that. Alright, I'm gonna set you down. Shouldn't take too long. It's just a suction cup. Oh man. Sweat. Salt water. Wash around. Alright. Right, right here. That's good. Alright. Do my little piece. Alright. That right down here. There we go. I'm gonna bend this a bit. No, can't do that. Alright. Get that right there. Alright, there we go. You got an open area. That and that. Let's see what I can do. Pick this up. Take the tube out. Stick the tube through here. Engineering me coming out. Take this. Where is it? Right. I'm gonna drop this whole thing. Right. You can't see any of this, can you? I'm gonna set this back. Right here. Let me check and see that it's a good place, man. It's not. Alright. There we go, now you get to see everything. You get to see stuff that I don't. Alright. This tubing. I really should have done this before. Alright. Take this off. Oh, man. Can you believe this? Look what I just, look what I just did. And my water is full of it. Alright, I'm gonna take that out somehow. That'll work. Let's see, let's see. This. I got a foot in that water dish now. Where do I put this? Just gonna just put it back here. Not a big deal. Alright. Just gonna add water. I'm pretty sure it's fine to add regular bottled water to salt water, isn't it? Alright, I'll make a part two. I'm gonna get this all ready. Alright, see you later.